had a very tough challenge at Stone next day against a very dangerous Saracen side. Uh, yeah, I think, well, we turn up, to, turn up to any game thinking we can sort of win it. Don't get me wrong, they're a good side, but I don't think we're ever thinking what the other side are doing. We're always sort of focused on ourselves. Um, coming away from it, there was definitely a few missed opportunities and I don't think it was a game we thought going into it we couldn't win. Um, so I think it's sort of my, our mistakes have sort of led to them beating us and obviously it was a good team with a few internationals in it. So yeah, it was disappointing, but plenty of sort of stuff to build on going into the next week. We spoke about making it hard for ourselves at time. Obviously, they were very dangerous every time they got the ball. They were very clinical, um, but we didn't help ourselves at, at times. Is that a fair assessment, do you think? Yeah, we just spoke in the sheds then about um, just how many turnovers we gave away. I think it didn't, obviously, like you say, it didn't really help us going forward. Um, our lineup probably didn't operate the way we wanted to as well as today. Obviously, especially in the point zone where we can get those try opportunities, I think it sort of let us down in that aspect. So, um, yeah, no, I think it was we sort of left a lot out there that we could have probably turned out to turn over points and then potentially come back the win. So, yeah, no, it's a lot of them six on us. You obviously were initially set to start on the bench. Um, side and played 76 minutes. How's the body after that one? Uh, yeah, no, it's good. I got the call from Dan. It was like exciting times in terms of like, I wasn't expecting it until last minute. So um, yeah, no, it was exciting to play against a team like that, a caliber of players that they've got. Um, but the body's held up okay. Um, I was more concerned about the fitness levels than anything, but no, we held on, so it was all right, yeah. We're, we're back at home, finally, next week in front of uh, Tiger's family at Matuli Woods Welford Road, uh, and we get to prove ourselves again. Yeah, no, it should be exciting against a good Harlequins team again. Does, there's no easy week in the pro at the moment, so I think it's exciting going. Obviously, like we said in the sheds then, there's, there's stuff to build, and hopefully we can take that into next week and come away with a win. And lastly, obviously, Saracens had all their internationals back this week, uh, and um, ours uh, yet to return. Um, does that change the approach of going into a game, or same preparation as if they were here or not? Yeah, no, exact same preparation. I don't think it changes that anything. To be fair, like we said, like I said a minute ago, just just because they've got England, England internationals, we don't this week. I don't think we went into this game thinking we're the underdogs. We're always sort of turning up, thinking we're going to win. It's just exciting to have those sort of boys back and obviously coming into the squad, it'd be good to see them again. So, yeah.